What is up, YouTube? This is the Sewer Rat. That's right, my inaugural video. Just want to do a quick one, showing my setup and introducing myself and a little bit about this channel. Not going to be anything, not anything wild or wacky, you know, but, I mean, as the Sewer Rat, it's down and dirty. So let's start, you know, let's just show you what I currently play on. This, you know, it's not the best, but it gets the job done. So we're just going to start, we're going to go through it. I'll tell you a little bit about myself. And then we'll, um, you know, we'll go from there. Currently, what I am, the panel I'm playing on is a 51 inch Samsung 1080p Plasma 3D. Yes, Plasma. A lot of people, uh, once again, the Sewer Rat's old school. I like Plasma televisions. I own two of them. I'm going to ride those Plasma televisions so the wheels fall off. Why? Great deep blacks. Very low input lag. And uh, just, you know, I enjoy plasma televisions. I think they give a great picture. And, you know, of course, a lot of people say, oh, burn-in, burn-in. Well, you know, burn-in has never been a factor for me. Why? Because I do a proper burn-in on my plasma televisions. And if you ever want to look up how to do that, uh, there's plenty of videos on YouTube. But let's put it this way. Most people these days are not going to be buying a plasma because... They phased them out. Most manufacturers of televisions are no longer using plasma technology, which is sad because um, they're they, they're great televisions. And this Samsung right here is I love it. Anyway, so I'm not going 4K. Don't plan on it anytime soon. Anyway, let's move on. The game up there, obviously, most people know that's Dark Souls 3. I'm going to be doing a playthrough of that. Obviously, I'll show some Let's Play videos. But this is the Sewer Rat, and I'm no expert. Never said I was the best. I'm an old man, so. I just play the games I enjoy, and you know that's what's playing right now. Next, um, next we have a PS4, not a Pro, not a Slim. We're talking about the original, the old school, the vanilla PS4. Uh, still works. I'm not, you know, other than a little bit of a disc drive issue, it's a little loud. I'm sure probably in the future I'll have to throw one in there, but I'm not going to upgrade that right now. That PS4 on a 1080p panel works great. Have I see no need to go with a pro um the slight incremental upgrade that the pro is over the vanilla just doesn't for me isn't worth it yet uh you know black friday sale down the line or something sure i'll grab one but right now that one rocks probably end up giving it to my son um when i do do that upgrade but currently i'm not gonna okay a little bit off to the right you'll see my pc that's my baby um it is a Skylake build. It's a i7 6700K. I'm running it right now at about 4.5 gigahertz. Oh, for, anyway, I'm running it at 4.5. And um, as you can see, got a couple 140 millimeter Noctua fans on a classic. The classics are always the best. The Sewer Rat's always going to tell you. It's always there's something about the classics it's a d14 in there i love the d14 i did water for a while but uh the d14 it still kicks butt other than that there's a 1080 in there i'm not going to show it to you it's an msi 1080 armor and um pretty basic system the case itself if you're wondering is a but most most pc heads will know that's a corsair air 540 which i just purchased uh, recently Switching over from uh, Corsair D550, which was a silent case, but we'll have a little separate video about those things later, because I'm going to tell you some great information about um, some of the marketing baloney that goes into a lot of PC gaming and how you can sift through that and uh, get the best what I like to call bang for your buck next to the computer a little lower there is just it's just an Ankyo uh, receiver I want to say it's a s5500 I don't know the exact designation it doesn't matter it's a it's a, it's a 7.1 surround sound receiver it's just there so that I can run HDMI from all my components get surround sound I usually use headphones but um, it does the trick uh, under there is just some speaker, a printer, which I haven't been using lately because I'm cheap about buying ink. I get tired of that. And some various games, and that thing right there is nothing but a spindle full of old discs, CDs, what have you. So that's my setup, yeah. 
Um, nothing special. The sewer rat keeps it cheap. The sewer rat uses what he has and, and makes the most of it. And I think that's what a lot of people should be doing. But, you know, this that's a discussion for um, a, a later video. I think this is just mainly me showing you what I currently play on. And I, you know, I own a Wii U that's upstairs in my living room. My kids enjoy that. I may bring it down here in the future for a Zelda Breath of the Wild playthrough. I just have to look at how I would want to hook that up to record videos on that. I don't know. I've heard Nintendo's kind of funky about that, but we'll see. I don't know what the issues are with it, but whatever. And um, I have a PS3. I also have a... Um, I have a PS3. I have a Wii. I have a Wii U. I used to have a Xbox One, got rid of it because that PC there makes Xbox One pretty redundant to me at least. I think if you own a PC and an Xbox One, you're kind of um, double dipping into the same realm of capability. But I guess the Xbox One for me personally would be sports games, Madden, but that PS4 does the trick for that. Uh, fighting games, what have you, but you can play all those things except for Madden, obviously, and maybe NBA Live. Oh, wow. They don't even make NBA Live anymore, but whatever. Um, so, yeah, uh, I've been personally, if you want to know some things about myself, I, uh, I'm a father of four, been an avid gamer since the 80s, came up on the Atari 2600 in television, ColecoVision. I mean, let's face it, I've played it, it's been a passion of mine, I enjoy gaming. I do it on my terms. I don't. Um, I enjoy the games I like to enjoy, mainly RPGs, action adventure, sports. You know, I like pretty much all of them. In fact, lately I've been on a very, almost uh, a huge addiction to uh, strategy games like XCOM 2 and uh, one personally that's really owned my soul for a while, haha, <laughs> Dark Souls, is um, not that game, but it's called Total War Warhammer, I recommend that game, amazing, I love the Total War series, so, yeah, but this is my setup, and you know, I hope people join me, I really just want, you know, a discussion, maybe a discussion with like-minded and like-aged gamers, young guys, young kids, what have you, you know, it's all good, love to hear from you, but older heads out there, those are the people that I most, um, I guess, relate to, obviously. And uh, so, yeah, you know, I'm glad to make a video. I'm enjoying, I've enjoyed gaming for a while, and I hope you can enjoy it with me. I, mean, I don't know how often I'll post. I'm open to requests of what you think I should play. You know, if it's something obscure and old school, hey, why not? I'm all for it. I've played them all just about. I have a extensive emulation catalog too, Raspberry Pi that's upstairs with a retro pie on there. I'll show you a video of that if you wish, and just uh, let me know, you know. And I don't do unboxings. I will do maybe a review of something I've purchased if it's relevant to what I feel I need to discuss. I am gonna, like I said, make a couple PC videos, and these are the only things I'm gonna make them for. The only reason is to just give my views on what. If you're at all interested in it, what really, what it really takes to get into PC gaming, people have, um, you know, some misconceptions. It's difficult. It's it's complicated. I don't feel that's the case. As you can see, I'm playing with my PC on my TV. I do not do the monitor thing. I like to game from my couch. I have everything set up wirelessly. I run a, um, and it plays just like any other console. If I need to, I can use a keyboard and mouse. I have a lap stand and all that stuff. But I have found that I very rarely need a keyboard and mouse for most games and strategy games. Even I have a wireless Logitech uh, keyboard and mouse with a touchpad. Works for some strategy games. Sometimes it doesn't have the fidelity you need from the mouse portion to really um, excel, but for me, I don't do a lot of multiplayer when it comes to strategy. I mainly just play the computer because I, once again, I, I, you know, as a father, career, mortgage, what have you, I just don't have the time to maintain those skills. So that's that. But this is what I usually use from my, um, my couch, which is where I'm sitting. That's my hand. It's, yeah, the sewer rag got a big hand. Anyway, never mind. But, yeah, that's the video. That's me. Down and dirty.
a little dusty. I got to do some cleaning. I re recently rearranged. I got some boxes to send to Goodwill. Got some old, uh, that's my, the box that the case came in with a blanket on it that my kids threw on there. But anyway, so, uh, nice to meet everybody. Again, YouTube, this is the Sewer Rat. Feel free to subscribe, like, do whatever you want. Make a comment. Talk shit. I don't care. You know, say what you want. It's a dusty down and dirty machine, dusty down and dirty, uh, set up gets the job done for me and the you know that's it anyway and again sewer rat is out take it easy thank you